Recalling that Liverpool signed Alexis McAllister for £35 million, it seems like a real broad daylight robbery. In this video, Vamosito will tell you how Alexis is leading the Reds to the league title and what makes him such a special player. Subscribe to us and let's get started! <laughs> Alexis McAllister became the first step of Liverpool's midfield revolution last summer. After the disastrous previous season, Fabinho, Jordan Henderson, James Milner, Alex Oxlade-Chamberlain and Nabi Keita left the team. They were replaced by Dominic Soboslai, Vataru Endo and Ryan Gravenberg, in addition to the Argentinian. In fact, this restructuring has been crying out for a long time and last season's fifth place was the catalyst for such actions. The main reason for changing the midfield was its predictability. The midfielders who left the team were good players, but they did not pose any threat for the opponent's goal. They could tackle and run a lot, but in general it was easy to play against them. This predictability was harmful to the whole team. Opponents knew that Henderson, Milner and others were not dangerous when Liverpool attacked, so they pulled all their efforts into containing the strikes and fullbacks. The numbers also confirm this. Over the course of last season, the midfielders who left the team played a total of 171 matches, scoring one goal and making seven assists. That is 0.05 goal contributions per match. Jumping ahead, here are the stats for McAllister this season. 36 games, 6 goals and 7 assists. That's it. He alone outscored all 5 midfielders who left the club. And the season hasn't even ended yet. Like this video if you are enjoying the Argentinians play for Liverpool this season. However, at the start of the season, no one expected Alexis to have a lot of goal contributions. The fact is that he started the campaign as a defensive midfielder. Liverpool failed to sign Moises Caicedo, while Vataru Endo needed time to adapt. The Japanese had never played for a top club in his career and had no experience in the Premier League. Besides, at first, Endo looked like a backup for another holding midfielder, whom Liverpool could have bought but didn't. So it was the Argentinian who became club's solution in this position. It's not that this role is new to Alexis. Last season he played enough games in this area for Brighton. However, his qualities are more suited to play closer to the opponent's goal. And in the Seagull squad he playing alongside Caicedo, who did most of the defensive work. Here, he had to get used to the role of the only defensive midfielder. McAllister is known for his excellent dribbling, passing ability, excellent ball control and a great shot. Not all of these qualities can be shown at the position of a holding midfielder. Nevertheless, the Argentinian proved to be a great fit in his new role and became a worthy solution to the problem. Throughout the first half of the season, he played mostly as a number 6, and no one had any complaints about his performances. However, there was a feeling that Alexis couldn't show all that he was capable of when playing in this role. Jurgen Klopp also realized this. Is Mecca a natural-born six? No. Did football develop in the last years in directions we couldn't imagine before? Yes. Does that mean that a player like Maka can play the six? Definitely. If we defend properly, then we have an incredible player in the central position who can find passes, a forward-thinking player, said the coach. This word spoken by Jurgen in the fall gave a hand that we would definitely see McAllister as an 8 on a regular basis. But no one could have guesses how much Alexis would explode in this position. With his excellent performances in a non-native position, McAllister gave Taro Endo the time he needed to adapt. After that, the Japanese allowed Liverpool's top 10 to move to a more advanced role. When the Premier League crossed the equator, Alexis still played as a holding midfielder for some time as Endo traveled to the Asian Cup. But from mid-February, the Argentinian started to play consistently as an 8. There is no other word to describe Alexis playing this position that magic. He not only gained more control over the game, but also started to regularly receive the ball between the lines and threaten the opponent's goal directly. 
Of course, we could have expected a certain increase in efficiency from McAllister, but nothing like what he did. Over the past six Premier League's matches, Alexis has scored three goals and made four assists. That's fantastic! Moreover, his goal contributions usually have a decisive impact. An assist for the winning goal against Nottingham Forest, an equalizer against Man City, an assisted winner against Brighton and the winning goal against Sheffield United – all of this have been provided by the Argentinian recently. Moreover, he does everything in style. The goal against Sheffield is a real masterpiece that you want to watch again and again. In this episode, we are all Virgil van Dijk and Ibrahim Konate. Against Fulham, they said I was lucky, I had to prove them wrong, Alexis said with a smile, recalling his previous masterpiece. That goal not only brought Liverpool three points, but also unlocked memories of Steven Gerrard. Doesn't it remind you of something? Alexis' similarities with Steven are not limited to this goal. The fact is that McAllister became the first Liverpool midfielder to make goal contributions in six consecutive matches since Gerrard in 2013. And here is Alexis' heat map in the match against Sheffield. By the way, due to Ando's injury, the Argentinian temporarily returned to the number 6 position in this game. Mental. Alexis McAllister is like the perfect mix of Steven Gerrard and Xabi Alonso. The sailing he has is unbelievable. LFC transfer room tweets. Indeed, the Argentinian is currently in such a form that he seems to have no weakness at all. He never loses the ball, has an elite passing culture and makes decisions on pair with the best players in the world. His scores in recent league games only confirm this thesis. Alexis McAllister has brought the two Liverpool has searched for years, a player who can unlock low blocks, fantastic creativity and sensitive passing in front of the opposition defense, can send the ball both low and high to teammates taking runs behind. 35 million pounds bargain, a fan of Twitter best describes Alexis. In less than a season, McAllister has risen in status among Liverpool fans to the level of Allison, Van Dijk and Salah. He is now considered that important and irreplaceable. This is a player I desperately wanted and thank God that we got him, Jurgen Klopp rejoiced. So Boslai, Endo and even Gravenberg, who has less playing time, have all threatened Liverpool's midfield. Each of them has multiplied goal contributions, however McAllister currently outshines them all. He has 10 goal involvements in his last 11 games across all competitions for Liverpool. This means that the Argentinian and his teammates have turned the Reds midfield into a threat for the first time in many years. Now opponents cannot focus only on the team's attackers and have to catch up everywhere. Given Liverpool's intensity, they rarely manage to do so. Alexis' performances not only add threat from midfield, but also free up the hands of all the other attackers players. As a result, Liverpool are the most prolific team in the top five leagues with a total of 125 goals. Xabi Alonso's Bayern Leverkusen rank second with 115 goals and Manchester City have 114. It is not surprising that the Reds are leading the Premier League and are also in the running to win the Europa League. And the key to this was one Argentinian world champion with the number 10 on his back. He's just an unbelievable footballer. I've never seen a player secure the ball so well. He's just so calm and composed on the ball. A wonderful footballer and a joy to play with. Can't praise him enough. Alexis' teammate Connor Bradley praises him. Friends, please write in the comments your impressions of Alexis McAllister's performances for Liverpool and whether you believe that the Argentinian will lead the Reds to the Premier League title this season. This was Vamosito Channel. Watch our videos and take care. Bye-bye.